This is an OSCE Station production and today I'm going to be taking you through how to do a cranial nerve examination. Hi, my name is Karen Rajan, I'm a fourth year medical student. The doctor has just asked me to quickly take a look at how the muscles and nerves in your head and neck are working. Would that be okay? That's fine. Okay, so um, are you in any pain at the moment? No. Okay, so could I just confirm your full name and date of birth please? Uh, that's Tristan Brown and yeah. it's 26th of August 1990. Okay, so how old would that make you? Oh, that makes me 21. 21, okay. So have you ever had this done before? Uh, no, no. Okay, so um, I mean, I'll talk you through it as we go along. It shouldn't take too long, about five to ten minutes, and uh, you shouldn't feel any discomfort at all. Uh, would you like a chaperone before we begin? No, that's fine. I'm just going to wash my hands. So, can I just begin by asking you if you've noticed any change in your sense of smell recently? Um, no, not that I can think of. Or any change in your taste? Uh, no, no, it's still the same. I don't notice anything different. Oh, okay, that's fine. And um, so, do you usually wear spectacles or any contact lenses? Uh, yes, I have contact lenses. Okay, and you're wearing them today? Yes. Okay, that's fine. So, if I could just quickly take you to, um, you know, close your right eye with your right hand. Yep. And if you could just uh, read as far down as you can. Um, a E Z B X J Y W. Okay, that's great. And if you just repeat the same thing with your other eye closed? A E Z J B X W. Okay, that's great. Thank you very much. Okay, and uh, I just want to test some other parts of your eye. So if you could just look at a point right directly behind me. Okay, and then if you could look at my hand. Okay, my fingers to be specific. And then keep looking at it. Okay, and then back at a, the point before. That's great, thanks. Okay, I'm just going to move slightly closer, that's right. Okay, uh, and now I'm just going to uh, move on to different parts of your eye now. Okay, so if you just keep looking at the bridge of my nose for me, I'm just going to be moving uh, my hands, and I just want to tell you, uh, you to tell me which side is moving. Uh, that side. That side. Both. Okay, that's great. <coughs> and now if you could close up your left eye with your left hand, okay, I'm going to do the same on this side. If you could just keep looking at the bridge of my nose, I'm going to be bringing my hand in from the sides and tell me when you can see it in your line of sight. I can see it. I can see it. Okay. I can see it. Okay. And just keep your hand there. Same thing. Tell me when you can see it moving. I can see it. I can see it. And I can see it. Yep. Okay. And if you could repeat the same with your other eye as well. I'm going to do the same here. And again, same procedure, just tell me when you can see my finger in your line of sight. I can see it. I can see it. I can see it. Okay, that's great. If you just keep your hand there. I can see it. I can see it. And I can see it. Okay, that's brilliant. Okay, and now I'm just going to be testing some of the reflexes in your eye. Mm -hmm. So if you could just keep your head still, and if you stare at the bridge of my nose again, I'm going to be shining this torch into your eye. Um, if you find it dazzling or uncomfortable at any point, please let me know and we can stop. Okay, so I'll just be shining in for a brief moment. So uh, if you just put your hand between the bridge of your nose like that, okay, and just keep staring straight forwards. That's great. I'm just going to do the same the, the other way. Okay, that's great. You can take your hand down now. And if you continue staring at the bridge of my nose, I'm going to be swinging the light between both eyes for just a brief period. Again, if you feel any discomfort, please let me know. That's great. Thank you very much. Okay, and um, <clears throat> so now I'm going to be testing some of the muscles in your eye. So again, uh, it's a bit repetitive. If you could look at the bridge of my nose again, and just uh, keeping your head still and with your eyes only, just follow the path my finger makes. Okay. And so just before I begin, uh, if you feel uh, dizzy or if your eyes hurt at any point, if you see any double vision, please let me know. Okay. okay, so again, with your eyes only, keeping your head still, uh, follow my finger. Okay, that's great. Um, and now I'm going to be testing some of the sensation uh, in your facial muscles. So if you could just, uh, what I'm going to do, 
this mm -hmm. cotton wool here. Sure. We're going to test it to your chest if that's all right. So this is what it'll feel like. Okay. I'm going to be touching it at various points in your face mm -hmm. uh, and you have your eyes closed. And I want you to tell me uh, if you can feel it. So say yes when you can feel it and if it feels the same on both sides and just say it if it does. Okay. okay, so if you just close your eyes for me. Yes. Yes, same on both sides. Yes. Yes, same on both sides. Yes. Yes, same on both sides. Okay, thank you very much. Put that away. Okay, and uh, I'm just going to test some of the muscle bulk as well in your face. So if you could just clench your jaw for me. Yeah, just going to be feeling like that. And again, keep your jaw nice and tightly clenched. Okay, that's brilliant. And if you could just open your jaw for me. Okay, and I'm going to just resist me. Don't let me push it in. Okay, that's great. Um, and if you could just open your jaw slightly for me, I'm just going to be tapping this lightly with this um, tendon hammer here. And uh, if you feel any pain, please let me know. So we just, okay, that's brilliant. And um, I just want to ask you now, have you noticed any change in your um, sense of taste again? No, you haven't. Okay. Or any sort of pain in your face at all? I've never pain in my face. Okay. So if you just keep still, I'm just going to have a look at your uh, face quickly. If you could just turn your head to one side. Okay. And then to the other side. Okay. That's great. So um, at this point, I will be testing in a bit more detail some of the muscles in your face. So I'm going to be asking you to pull some... Uh, you know, uh, different expressions of the face. So if they might be, they might look quite silly, but this is, uh, we need to find out exactly uh, how everything's working. So if you could just copy what I do. So first of all, if you could just smile for me, and then frown, okay, and then raise your eyebrows, and then scrunch up your eyes, and don't let me open them. Okay, that's great. And if you could puff up your cheeks, and don't let me push them in, okay? And just show me your teeth. Okay, that's great. Okay, and um, now I'm going to be moving on and testing the uh, function of your ears. Um, have you noticed any dizziness or any change in your balance recently? No. no okay, no. or any change in your hearing at all? No, my hearing That's fine. fine, and it's the same in both ears? Yes. Yeah, okay, so this is a tuning fork, and uh, you'll sort of hear a, a vibration noise or a sort of buzzing noise. So I want you to tell me in which position you'll hear it louder. So I'll just, uh, for an example, this is position one. Okay. And this is position two. I'll do that again. So and just tell me in which position it's louder. Okay. Position two. Position two. Okay. I'm going to repeat the same on the other side as well. Position two. Position two. Okay. And then one last test. I'm going to be placing this again after tapping it in the middle of your forehead. I'd like you to tell me in which side you can hear it the loudest or if it's the same on both sides. Same on both sides. Same on both sides, okay. Can you just open your mouth out wide for me? Okay. Uh, and if you could stick your tongue out. That's great. Thank you very much. Okay, so just before we finish, I'm going to be doing one last test. So I'm going to be moving, moving behind you, okay. testing your shoulders. So if you could just uh, raise your shoulders for me, and don't let me push down. Okay, that's great. And then now, if you could just move your head to the left, okay, and don't push, just push against my hand. Okay, that's great. And then move, turn your head to the right and push against my hand. That's great, okay. Thanks for that. Okay, so that concludes my examination. I'm gonna report my findings to the doctor and then you can go see him and I can have a discussion with you. Um, so that's it on my part. Is there anything you'd like to ask me? No, that's fine. That's great. Okay, well, thank you very much. Okay, so to uh, conclude my examination, obviously I'll do the things that were missing during this examination. So I'll do the pain sensation in the face as well as temperature. I'll also do the corneal reflex as well as the gag reflex. And I'll take a full history, do a full upper and lower limb neurological examination, a mini mental state exam, and also do a uh, fundoscopy. So this concludes the Oski Station showing of the cranial nerve examination.